Hey guys, it's Warrior Chicken. Welcome back to Resident Evil. So I'm not gonna lie, I am very stressed out right now. Um, not only did we just find this new residence that we've been exploring, we've had a whole bunch of new enemies that I have no idea how to handle. We have this massive spider hanging around in this red room here on the first floor. Um, we didn't get everything in there, but I just, I don't want to go back. <laughs> Uh, we also came across a demon plant, which I believe is a part or a bulb of uh, the plant 42 that they were talking about in the journal. And of course, none other than sharks and the aqua ring. But <laughs> the good news is, is after this super high stress, panic induced, trying to drain the water thing, I believe it actually drained. So I don't know if I should go back up the ladder or if I should take a peek over here because... The door looks like it's actually unlocked now. Um, I don't know if I should have went back up. Maybe I should go back up actually because there is a room up there that I missed. Okay, yeah, actually we're gonna go back upstairs. Um, and we're gonna go check out what was in that unlocked door. Maybe... No, I don't think we need to go back to the item box. I should probably save, but... I don't want to. I, I know, it's so bad. It's so bad, I should save, but I'm just, I'm not doing it right now. Um, because I know I'm gonna end up saving at the end of this, but I have my shotgun at the ready. If anything bad comes out, I'm sure we could just run away and <laughs> go, go back. Oh my god, it's still moving. Oh my god. <laughs> I feel really bad though. I mentioned this in the last video. I hate I hate killing animals. It's a really sad thing. Oh! What in the fuck is that? Okay. Um we're we're not going in there. I don't- I don't have anything that could possibly- Jesus Christ, shark, just die. Okay, you know what? <laughs> no mercy for the sharks. All the other ones, I do- I do feel really, really bad for. You know, especially the zombie dogs. Those ones are really, really hard to kill. Honestly, I feel like so many games I've played have had some version of an evil dog, and it's just like, why would you do that? Out of all things, that's like my- one of my favorite animals. Like, you guys probably know, I am a cat person. I have two cats. I love them so much. I'm happy there's no zombie cats, but... I do love dogs. Very much. Animal lover here. Okay, so we have it unlocked, a door there, and we have one... Out here. Okay, I have my shotgun at the ready, so... What's going on over here? The materials are labeled DYNAMITE! They're soaked to be on use. Okay, good. Because I don't want to accidentally blow myself up. Grenade shells! Okay, I will take that. Maybe that's a sign I should bring my grenade launcher. Diving suits and nets. There doesn't seem to be anything of use. Ooh, I kind of want to save. But I'm gonna take a peek in here first. Yeah, I got everything in that room, so... Oh wait, where are we now? Oh, we're back in the aqua ring. Okay. <laughs> Stop it, I know you're doing that on purpose. Just to scare me. Oh fuck, there's still water there! Um, he's gotta still be alive then. Mm. Does this go anywhere? There's gotta be something I gotta grab over here. Various types of machinery, you have no idea what they're used for. Please don't come back to life. Oh, what's, what's this? 
The water flow control system, it doesn't have power. The generator unit for the water control system. Pull the lever down. Okay. Oh, does that like restore power? This thing looks like it could electrocute you. <gasps> oh my god, it's still alive. Uh But it's like not moving, so like is it though? If only there was some way to drop it into the water. Oh! Oh! Okay, then how the fuck do you expect me to do this if I can't push it? Uh, this way? Or this, this way? Oh, I know what to do! I'm gonna turn the power off, and then I'm gonna push it in the water. I'm so fucking stupid, I am sorry. Oh, I see! Okay, so we're gonna electrocute the shark. Oh, this is so cruel. Deep sixth. The generator unit, it's toasted. Yeah, I think that's toasted too. But there's no way it's safe for me to go back into the water now, right? Do like electrical currents stay in the water? Oh no, this see, I never took physics. Never taken a physics course. So I, I don't really... Okay, I guess we're good. Oh, there's something over there. We take the residence key. Oh, gallery! There was a gallery room. Oh, this is perfect. Okay, I guess now we can kind of make our way back to the residence then. And I feel a little bit safer over there. You know, maybe I'm going to play it risky again and not... <gasps> not save again. Because I have a lot of health items. And I've been hoarding them. And I think the fact now that I'm on... Um, I think I mentioned this in the last video, but now that I'm on... Well, I've always been on the difficulty easy... Um, I've been saving stuff enough, I think, that I could probably just start using it because there shouldn't be too much of a short supply. At least this is what you guys are telling me, so I'm just listening to you. Oh, there's another door over here, though. Okay, fine. We'll take a look. Please don't make me regret this. Oh, it's the pretty music again. We take the magnum rounds. See, we got the self-defense gun in the last video, and it said that one took magnum rounds, but you guys were hyping up the magnum so much. You guys were so upset that I used it in the last, uh, last week's videos. <laughs> so I put it away, but I guess we could save that and see which gun would be better to use that for. The materials are packed up tightly. This place looks just like a garbage dump. I hope that this leads back to the residence. Oh my god, watch it bring me back to like the spider room. Oh. You unlocked it. Is this like one of the lockpick rooms? Oh, we're back here! Hell yeah! We are back to safety, my friends. Not that way. That way's not safety. Oh, that's so good to know. Did I get everything in this area, though? I think I did! I think that this went smoothly. Now we just have to go back up to the residence gallery. Okay, you know what, guys? It's okay. It's okay. If I was playing on, like, normal or hard, maybe I wouldn't be playing as risky, but I think I've kind of got the hang of Resident Evil thinking, I guess. So I think- oh gosh, those are probably also famous last words of mine. I'm getting too cocky, but I feel like I'm okay. But every time I say that, something new comes out.
but in here it's just zombies. Zombies. Z Was there anything? Like, can I kill the beehive? I guess not. Get away from me. Get away from me. Okay, I'm gonna go put my stuff back into the item box. And I think I'm actually gonna organize it. Yes, okay, I think I'm finally gonna organize my item box right now and just get it out of the way. And you guys can see my pristine organizational skills. <gasps> nope. Oh my god, I almost- I almost did it again! Those fucking tentacles. So now I know what, what they would have done if I was in the mansion, and I guess if I went too close to them, but I guess I was more careful there. So, that is... Yes, this is our item item room. Okay. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do a little bit of organizing, and then we're gonna continue. Okay, I just realized that this is actually gonna take way too long, so I don't actually want to do that anymore. <laughs> okay, so now I think we can go to the, the gallery and check out what's in there. Um, I think I should probably gain the courage to go back and kill that spider too because that room is huge and we're going to be bound to run into a point where we're probably going to eventually have to go back in there. Okay, I believe the gallery is this way. So just to show you what I still have on me, I still have two healing sets, two shotguns, and the key, obviously, to unlock it. And then we'll have lots of space to pick up stuff if we have to. Um, I'm thinking that for the spider, I might try out the grenade launcher. I feel like I have a lot of ammo for that. And it's also probably the first kind of like big weapon I got in the game. And maybe it's time to use it. I don't know how OP it is or if it's gonna, you know, be better now or later. I don't really know, but I figured we can just kind of experiment with it. No further use for this key. Each key only opens like one freaking door. <laughs> They're really kind of pushing you in a direct path with this one. What kind of room is this? <gasps> More bees! <laughs> Old award certificates line the shelf. How do you kill the bees though? Or you just like have to avoid them? Most of them are from the city or the army. Oh my fucking god, bees. Lab equipment you've never seen before. Could these have been used for some kind of experiment? How do I get that handgun magazine? Sure, I didn't bring my handgun though. Oh my god, this room is huge. I don't want to have to deal with all of these bees. Go away. A corpse with a contorted expression of pain on his face. That is horrifying. He's holding something. Insecticide spray! Cool, this is gonna have to be to kill Plant 42. God damn thief. I've gotta figure out a way to kill them. Oh, that's this doesn't go anywhere, but there's- Yeah, there's an item. Stop! It's too dangerous to go any further. Oh, is that the beehive? Oh, that's the fucking beehive. Okay, that- that's obvious. Now we know where they were all coming from. Is that guy gonna be a zombie? He doesn't look like he's turned. But I also don't want to take a chance. An assortment of old test tubes and flasks. The lock mechanism for the door. Use it. Oh fuck, you wanna know what this looks like? This looks like the symbol that they um, made you look at with the spider, that red lamp in the room, it made an eye. They all look different though, so maybe I should pay attention to the shape of it. And maybe it corresponds with a number? Oh fuck, this is gonna be a hard one. I genuinely don't really have a clue, but 
Then again, I didn't stay in that spider room very long. Oh, there's a door there. Oh, the- oh, the- oh, it's for the door. Okay. I had a feeling we were eventually gonna get stumped. Let's try this one, actually. The door plate reads 003. And what about this one? It's blocked from the other side. God damn it. Okay. I will take that. Okay, we're gonna head back to the item box. And I'm gonna suit up for a nice fight with a spider. I'm gonna grab the grenade launcher. I don't really know which ammo shells I should use. I have, like, the fire ones. I know I have acid ones. I don't know about the rest of them, but we can wing it. I'm sure there's probably some that are better for different things, but I haven't found, like, any clues that have talked about that, I guess. And there's no way we can really avoid that spider. That spider's a dick. He just wants to spray me with whatever he was spraying me with. Yeah, I don't know what would work. If he was, like, spitting acid... Which, I don't really know what kind of spider it is, or what it would do. So... I don't know if that would be kind of stupid to use against him. Or we could light him on fire. I feel like fire would always work. Hmm. Maybe... Maybe I'll make- I'll make uh, make- ugh. Be a little bit of a concoctionist right now. We'll be like one of these lab people. We're gonna make another mixed herb. I have lots of green herbs. <laughs> I'm definitely gonna organize this on my own time because I started and I was like, yeah, this, this is gonna be 30 minutes. Should I bring my handgun? Nah. Not yet. Not somewhere we've already been. Maybe to the next, next room. Do I have any more handgun ammo? No, I guess that's it. Okay. So I'm going to put... What am I going to put back? Oh, wait, I forgot the grenade launcher already has, like, ammo in it. I just don't know what. Oh, should I still keep that shotgun on me? Fuck it. I think we probably got most of the things in there. Okay, let's combine it with that. Oh, is this just normal now? Oh, it's just normal. They're filled with high explosives. You know, maybe I will just try the regular one since we haven't actually used it. And we'll keep these if that, if that doesn't work. Okay, so hopefully nothing jump scares me and I don't waste this ammo on something else on the way. Okay, let's go kill that spider and examine the rest of that room. Because it definitely has to do with the gallery. <laughs> Brace yourself, guys, if you hate spiders for going back in. Okay. Where? Where are you? I hear you. Are you on the ceiling? Are you on the ground? Okay, he's on the ground. Eh! Okay, I think it killed it. Did he grow that herb? Or was that herb always there? <gasps> oh! Oh, yeah, I, I probably don't want to step in that. <gasps> Fuck, I'm poisoned! I'm an idiot. I kill the goddamn spider and I get poisoned after. I'm a fucking idiot. Okay. Let's go get some of that, <laughs> that fucking blue herb. I'm so fucking stupid. I am so stupid. Mm. Imagine and then if I walked into the tentacle and it, like, strangled me and I just died. Oh, I should have saved before I did this. Okay. Jill, hang on. I think I actually have a combined one over here. Of a blue and a, and a green. There we go. We will take that. And we're fine. Okay, I can probably put these away, but I'm gonna keep the grenade launcher on me. Just for now. Because I just, I don't like anything. But two hits, that's not too bad, considering how many grenade launcher shells we have. Pretty good. I 
I just don't know how we're gonna get rid of those bees. Unless if we burn the nest. There's gotta be a way to burn the nest. Okay. Good, you're gone. Okay, let's examine this again. It literally just looks like an eye. With winged eyeliner. Just like me. No, I'll just remember that. Oh, hello. <laughs> oh, darts. Swimsuit ladies. It was a good time in here. Was this like a record player? A leather jacket. Part of it has been burned by acid. What about this, though? This looks like a modern item that I should be able to interact with. Maybe not. Maybe if I get a CD player or a CD, I can put it on there. Yeah, we'll pick up the herb. Now I guess we're free to explore. Spider free. Oh! <gasps> What the fuck is that upstairs? I really hope that's just like a cloth hanging from the ceiling. That is not a cloth hanging from the ceiling. I should have brought another fucking blue herb. God damn it, I'm supposed to light this one too! <laughs> this is where Resident Evil is starting to get to me. Oh, maybe! Each eye. Maybe there's three of them, and they're three different eyes, and they have to do with the, with the lock. Okay, let's go kill this. I'm pretty sure there's another spider here. And another butt. You're blocked inside! Fuck you! Some billiard balls. Two, three, four, five, six. There doesn't seem to be anything significant about the order. But... But what? Oh no, is this gonna have to do with the lock too? Oh my god. Okay, you know what? Let's not worry about this now, and we'll go check out all the eyes. Damn, there's a lot of, lot of ladies in here. <laughs> guitar case is empty. Well, no shit, the guitar is over here. Oh, Joe, we got you playing piano. Can we get you to play some guitar? <gasps> there it is! An orange oil lamp. Wait. Okay. I know what to do. There's a green lamp. There's an orange lamp. And there's a red lamp. And they have significant symbols. However, I don't know how the symbols translate into these, um... Into these numbers. So I think we're gonna have to light up the lamps. And... See if it has anything to do with these numbers. And that's gotta be the code, right? If it is, these puzzles are just so much more complex now. I feel like the mansion now is almost a tutorial. Even though I thought it was like the whole game. I thought this game just took place in a mansion. I think this game's just starting to appear to be a lot bigger than I originally thought. I think that's the most surprising part. I don't think I expected this complexity in an old game. However, I know there is a lot of parts that were never um, in the old game, they were in the remake. Um, like for example, I guess that monster in chains area, someone mentioned that, that caught them by surprise when they replayed the game, not expecting that. Okay, let's actually Take this blue herb. I'm gonna make another blue herb concoction. I don't think that spider is a threat right now, but I'm just gonna make it. Just so we can get it quicker. Okay. Gotta grab the lighter. You're right, I should organize this. I should have just did it. <laughs> but I keep putting it off. Where the fuck is my lighter? Oh, right there. Okay. Let's go. 
I'm still gonna carry this grenade launcher on me. Because I realized that there's more ammo than I thought. And anything that isn't a zombie or dog is gonna get this. I feel like that spider's gonna come down. I'm scared that maybe once I like light all the candles, it's gonna like trigger a scripted event and the spider's gonna come down. Okay, so the red is like a normal winged eyeliner, a normal cat eye. And then there's one down here. Okay, this one's green. Okay, so this one doesn't have any eyeliner, but it's got two eyelashes. <laughs> two eyelashes. Could it have some kind of meaning? Yes, I'm starting to get it now. Oh, critical thinking skills. This game's gonna make me so smart. Okay, so we had winged eyeliner. <laughs> we had two eyelashes. We'll see what this one is. Three eyelashes on top and one on the bottom. Oh, come on! So I gotta light these up too? Okay, well, red is three. Oh, oh, okay, actually, I lied. I know exactly what to do. So three, five, and six. So now we can go input that. Oh, wait, what was what? Okay, the red one is three. The green one is six. The orange is five. Okay. I feel like if not, we could just probably try it a few times. Unless if it's like you get it wrong, and then it's like... Oh, you're just trying to guess? Well, uh, here's a spider. Or maybe the bees will, like, attack me. I don't know. I will try. I'm gonna switch so I don't accidentally use the grenade launcher on the bees. But I just don't see how you could shoot them. Like, I feel like you need a handgun for, like, that kind of, kind of precision. But I guess I could just try and avoid them. Oh, this is not the room I thought we went into. Okay, well, I guess we can just put the lighter back then. Oh, fuck it. Okay, I'm gonna put the grenade launcher back, and I'm gonna take my handgun back. <laughs> in case we have to shoot some bees. I'm gonna leave this magnum revolver in there. Until we figure out what we gotta do with that. Holy shit, I actually have a shit ton of handgun magazines. Oh my god, 64? I think there's more down here too. <gasps> okay, the handgun has to be our weapon of choice now. We'll just constantly shoot at things. I wonder how many shots the spider would have taken if I um use the handgun. Okay. I know I keep saying this, but I promise, I promise, next week when I film, I'm gonna save more often. I think just now that you guys are kind of saying that I'm being a little bit too cautious on such a low difficulty, I'm just kind of playing for fun now. Okay. Yeah, let's see if we can shoot a bee. We can shoot like 104 bees, so <laughs> it's okay. Okay. Let's try this. Okay, so this was our first one. This is our second one. This is our third one. So this was red, and that was three. That's three. Oh, shit. One was five, and one was six. Is that you? Did I do it? No! Shit, okay, are you six? And then you're five? And then you're three? Maybe you're five? 
Maybe you're a six. <laughs> okay, the bees didn't like that, but but we're but we're in. We did it. Ugh, there's like cockroaches. There's something written on the wall. One plus three equals four. Four plus six equals ten. One plus six equals seven. I know math. Yellow six. Need a container to put it in. Oh no, I don't like where this is going. There's bottles everywhere. And if this actually does have to do with math, I'm out. UMB number three. You take the empty bottle. Oh no. I gotta- there's four bottles. Oh my fucking god, what do I do in here? One plus- okay. <laughs> Does it have to do with like this being number three? Take some. Alright. Sure. Okay, maybe I can fill them all up? Sure. Fuck, do I gotta put something away? Fill the empty bottle with water? I'm so confused. There's gotta be something I missed. That's gotta tell me what the fuck I'm doing. Maybe it's in here? Okay, well, regardless, I'm gonna go put... Something away, so I can have all four bottles. Did I just kill the bees? myself up with these bees here. Okay, I think... I think that's it. Wow! I'm just dumb. Okay, well at least the bees are out of the way. Does that mean I can go down here now? No. Oh. oh. Oh, I know what I'm gonna- No! Oh my god, I was gonna grab my grenade launcher and blow it up. But there's gotta be something else I gotta do. Mmm, what do I do? Nope. I think I just wasted a shotgun shell on a bee. Come on, there's gotta be something in here that's gotta tell me what to do. You know what? I'm actually just gonna use up this herb. And now we gotta look. Oh my god, the bees are still moving too. There's gotta be a clue for this, right? Or is it just whatever's on the wall there? Okay, let's- let's try this again. Okay, so I guess we probably need to get all the solutes in a bottle. And maybe just mix the ones that have the corresponding number to whatever is on the wall. Okay, which one did we not get? Okay, we got water, we got yellow, and we got red. Is there another one? No, there isn't! Wait. Hmm. Okay, what did it say on the wall? One plus three equals four. Would this be one? One plus three make four? Oh, it did! 
I'm so smart. Okay. So, six plus what then? Oh, either one plus six or four plus six. But that's a four, so can I do that? Oh, we got ten! Okay, so what's ten plus what? Ten plus seven. How do I make a seven? Can I make a seven? One plus six. Oh, shit. This one was six, right? No, that was a three. Maybe I could do two threes and it makes a six. No, it just made four a three. Okay. But then I don't even know what to do with it after I, I figure it out. Okay, we got another another one, I guess. Okay, so we have a 10. I'm totally missing something. I'm absolutely missing something. Can I dump it now? Oh no. What am I doing? Okay guys, so this is where <laughs> things get boring because I have no idea what I'm doing. Hmm. Am I missing something from here that's supposed to tell me? Hmm. Okay, give me a second. Let me see if there is anywhere I might have missed. Okay, I honestly can't think of anything. It has to be this. So, are we trying to get to 20? Because if we're trying to get to 20, we're at 10. So then, do we just not make another 10? Hmm. Can I dump out my water? I don't think I can. <laughs> okay. So, maybe I can combine this again with that. Okay, we've got four again, so we're at 14. And then we need another six. Is this six? It's not letting me click it, so maybe I don't need it anymore. No, this was yellow six, was it not? Oh, there we go. Okay. That? Does 10 plus 10 equal 20? No, I need 17 plus 3? What happens if I just do that? Oh no. Okay, I guess that's how you empty it. <laughs> okay, let me try this again. Number okay. No. So we need to get to seven. So I need a one and a six. So this plus water should equal seven. I'm so sorry guys. This is probably brutal to watch. Okay, there we have seven. And now we just... If I add these two... Woohoo, we're at 17. Okay, now we just need a three. And three plus 17 equals... B jolt. Um, what the fuck am I supposed to do with Vigil? It's a distinctively brown liquid. Oh, that's just great. Okay, well this is obviously what I was supposed to make, but what do I do with it? I'm gonna have to go use it somewhere. I can't think of where I'm supposed to use it. I guess we're just gonna have to go... Hmm... Maybe we can use that on the beehive. 
Matey. God, the bees are back. Why did I even waste my ammo? It's too dangerous. Nope. So where else could I go with this? Especially if I don't have... Ugh. Okay, the only thing I can think of to do now would be to head back to the only parts of the residence that we haven't actually finished. And I think we're going to have to go back down to the aqua ring. Which I don't want to go back to, but... Okay, I'm actually going to go put these bottles in the item box. Uh, we'll reload all our weapons. I'll probably bring the grenade launcher and we'll just kind of check again with what we can... We'll just try it on every room that looks like it hasn't been solved, I guess. Okay, so I guess we're gonna go back in here. We're gonna go all the way down the ladder again. Uh, fun stuff. So, I'll just show you quickly what I brought. I bought <laughs> extra health, because I don't trust myself, but I just brought the handgun magazine because I think we could just kind of go through that and it should be fine. I, I really do regret using them on the bees, like, I don't know where my logic was, but I didn't think that the fact that there's a beehive, obviously more bees would come out. Just, just please, let's forget about that. We still have a hundred, so, <laughs> well, I think it's okay. Um, oh, I guess we could actually use this shortcut then. We'll try this one out so we don't have to go through the whole shark thing. The music is so nice here though, but I hate it because it's making me calm, but I know I should be scared. Hmm. The worst part is, is they're all green. I figured that if there was something to be done, it'd be red, but I, I honestly, I just can't think of where else to go at this point. It wouldn't be in there. Because that was like the control room. I can't even remember what was over here. <laughs> even though I just did this like an hour ago. Okay, we're back in this... Aqua ring. Oh, I have an idea. Okay, how do I get back up to the first floor of the aqua ring? Because there was one room there, and it had... How are these things still alive? I literally drowned them an hour ago. These are some resilient sharks. <laughs> oh, obviously. Obviously, they were experimenting on it, so maybe it can, can survive some pretty, pretty fucked up stuff. Okay. So, let's go in here and we'll take the ladder up. And... Maybe we can do something. <sighs> okay, I might have an idea. Since this is the only area that we haven't solve the room for. I think I might have to go back, but I do want to just check it out. See if it works first. Let's say this was a guard room. Yeah, yeah, it was the plant. Can I use this? <gasps> oh my god, it did work! Okay, yeah, I had another idea that I would have to load it into something and maybe, um, maybe shoot it. Okay, actually, oh, I'm, I'm glad then that that worked first try. The locker is completely soaked. There's nothing special inside. 
Okay, good. It took the bottle away. So now we have extra inventory space. Okay, what is going on over here? It looks like the control system for the water tank, but it's broken and can't be used. Okay, what was the point of coming over here then? If there's nothing in here. There's no way I just took care of this plant for no reason, is there? <gasps> it's gotta give me a key or something. I'm getting nothing. Nothing. Hmm. I wonder if that was the plant that was, um, like, poking out of the hole in the residence. Like, I wonder if that's where it was, uh, like, situated and it was reaching up, if that's kind of how the residence works. Is there anything else over here? Or is this- no, this just goes backwards. Hmm. I'm absolutely missing something here, but I can't think of what. Unless if there's maybe a new scripted event th that comes from that. But I can't even think of anything. Oh my god, I have to go the other way. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna head back to the residence then. And I'll see if I can think of anything along the way. Alright guys, it's finally that time again. We can save, finally. I do not want to have to do any of that again. I know I keep playing risky, but I'm going to try and push myself to start saving a bit earlier on when I play. <laughs> because look at this, we're gonna be on save number seven now. So now it's finally time to end this episode off here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and we will pick up here in the next video and try and figure out what to do next because I'm a little bit stumped but maybe a little bit of a break will help me to stimulate some thoughts about it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!